Hello everybody, welcome to this video, Claudemir here again. Let's talk today about analog resolution. This is very important for CCTV. We have old camera with analog resolution, but it's important to understand that. This is the content of the Ultimate Security Camera Guide, link here in the description. So click, get yours, and don't forget to subscribe to the channel, leave your thumbs up, your comments, and also hit the bell notification so you can receive more information about videos like this one. Let's get started here with analog resolution. Here you can see a universal chart that use it to measure the analog resolution. So basically, in analog resolution, you have TV lines on your camera. So the camera is generating TV lines that you can see here, and your monitor are going to show the TV lines. As many TV lines as you have in your camera, it's better, so you have better resolution. Of course, I'm talking again about analog resolution, not IP, not digital. I'm talking about analog resolution, right? So here, 600 TV line, it's an example of common cameras you used to find everywhere. But you also have different resolution like 540, like 380, old camera, really old camera has like, have this type of resolution, okay? So basically here, you connect your camera with the coaxial cable and then you can see the resolution on the TV, on the monitor. Of course, it's a professional monitor. If you have 600 TV lines here in your camera, you need to have 600 TV lines on your monitor or even more. If your monitor is like 800 TV lines, there's no problem, but you can't have the opposite. You can't have like a 400 TV lines monitor with 600 TV lines camera because you not be able to see all the resolution from the camera, right? So here's an example of the chart that's used for uh, analog measurement. So you measure the TV lines, basically you point a camera to this chart and then you can read in the monitor how many TV lines the camera has, right? So that's old stuff, right? But it's important to learn that. Nowadays, it's not measured by looking at the chart. You use an oscilloscope to do that, an electronic device that measure it much, much better. But it's also still necessary to point to a chart so you can have like some lines that a camera can read and can measure the resolution, right? And it's important to understand something. I have here in the Ultimate Security Camera Guide uh, some information about the difference between analog and IP. Don't confuse stuff, right? People usually confuse stuff like saying, oh, uh, my camera is 720p, my camera is 1080p, my camera is megapixel. Here, I'm not talking about this kind of resolution because 720p, 1080p and megapixel are digital resolution. Here, I'm talking about analog resolution. You're gonna learn more about digital resolution later in other videos or in other guides that I have here, but make sure you don't confuse these terms, right? Don't confuse, let's say 4K with um, analog resolution. You can convert uh, from analog to IP. You can use an encoder, you can use a DVR, so you can convert from analog to digital. Then you start talking about 720, 1080p, you can talk about megapixel, but as long as you're talking about analog resolution, stick to the TV lines, all right? Old stuff, but it's necessary to understand because if you're a good professional, you understand everything since the beginning, right? And also keep watching all the videos here in the channel. So that's why I ask you always to subscribe to the channel, hit the bell notification so you can receive more information about new videos and also leave your comments and your thumbs up. See you in the next video.